My name is Lori Richards. I'm a painter and we are here at Wall Space Gallery. This is my latest collection of work. It's quite eclectic and that's how I work. I, I love to work with landscape but I like to abstract it but I'm totally inspired by the spaces and the colors that I see around me. I often have to wait for there to be a real emotional connection for me to want to translate what I see into art. So it's got to go from just a picture of landscape to something more connected to the human spirit, I think. This painting, which is called Wild Bunch, it is inspired by a summer, summer field of flowers, but I wanted there to be not only freshness and beauty and the idea of spring, but I wanted there to be power and energy within it. And this piece, which is called Field Sculpture, is inspired by the fields that are right outside my home. And I love to walk in the woods and the fields. And there was this one tree that always stopped me in my tracks that was dying and it was so beautiful and so sculptural as it kind of lost all its leaves and became this beautiful sculpture of just wood. Um, and I, you know, sometimes I don't even know how it comes out but all of a sudden I realize what I'm painting. When I discovered the work of Peter Doig, I, was, I, was gonna say, yeah. I have to admit that I felt so connected to his work because it it's very descriptive and there's a lot of landscape but there's also some figures and when I saw his work and for the first time at the National Gallery I saw that big painting I stood there and looked at it for probably an hour because I loved his sense of color and I'm a colorist I would say first and foremost I think landscape painting might be something that's a bit out of fashion but when I saw his work I went okay it's okay that you do landscape and that you love it and that you can take it different places I'm always wanting to explore and kind of go back and forth between um, more uh, classical mm -hmm. painting and drawing and then pushing the boundaries. Well, I adore Cezanne. That was going to be the next person that I said really? because Cezanne, I have actually, I have a book of his that I do keep around because I, I just absolutely adore the way he, the way he breaks up space and abstracts landscape and his color totally resonates with me. You know, there's times when I wish I was an abstract painter because I love abstract art and it's very modern. And, but then I have to remember what charges me and what I want to put down and it's who I am and you just have to embrace it. So, um, but I'm always pushing the boundaries myself. So who knows what I'm going to do next. I, I really felt that that kind of imagery would really help cue the whole idea of this early Canadiana harsh wilderness theme that I had going on with my head and